Ils ont fait irruption dans la maison du suspect, mais une erreur de débutant les a humiliés devant le monde entier. Le couple dormait paisiblement avec son bébé quand, venu de nulle part, plusieurs officiers sont apparus pour faire un raid. La tension était forte, mais personne ne savait ce qui se passait. La situation était très tendue. Les policiers insistaient pour que le couple sorte, mais aucun d'entre eux ne comprenait les raisons de tout cela. Ils ne semblaient pas savoir ce qu'ils avaient fait pour provoquer une telle descente dans leur maison. Ils ne savaient pas quoi dire ni comment agir. Mais ils étaient là, avec leur fils dans les bras, s'affrontant aux autorités. La surprise serait grande lorsqu'ils sortiront le couple de la maison et que les policiers se rendront compte de l'erreur impardonnable qu'ils avaient commise. My attorney is going to okay. eat yeah, this. Yeah, we're, we're, we're gonna get in a lot of trouble. My lawyer is, is going to I'm eat sure. this. Where is he at? I have no fucking idea. You see them cameras right there? That's good. You I'm guys glad. are fucked. I'm happy for, for the cameras. Let this man come to my house for a person I don't Listen. even know? I don't know him. Ce qu'on fait, ces policiers, n'est pas un incident isolé. Il existe plusieurs cas dans lesquels des agents pénètrent dans des maisons mais finissent par prendre la mauvaise direction, générant un énorme traumatisme pour ceux qui y vivent. Car bien sûr, ce n'est pas drôle de se réveiller et d'être confronté à une brigade armée prête à tuer. Chicago police officers stormed into Anjanette Young's home on February 22, 2019, attempting to execute a search warrant. But records show the officers had the wrong home. As she stood there, naked and helpless, armed officers searched Young's home. Putting handcuffs on me while I was naked. No one should have to experience that. Anjanette Young stood with her attorney today in front of Chicago Police Headquarters, calling out the officers involved. They didn't serve me. They didn't protect me. They didn't care about me. After trying to distance herself from the city's attempt to block the video from being publicly released, Mayor Lightfoot apologized. I am 
deeply sorry and troubled that her home was invaded and that she had to face the humiliation and trauma that she suffered. That is just not right. It simply should not have happened. Dans de tels moments, le stress monte en flèche, car la peur n'est pas des moindres pour les personnes qui souffrent de ces erreurs policières. It's about 1.30 in the morning. They're still banging on the door. I told them over and over again, they're at the wrong address. They keep yelling out 4663, and that is the wrong address. They are not at the right place. You're not at the right place. Please stop. There are about four or five officers outside and, the, and a bunch of cars. They're shining bright lights in my home. We're very scared and we've called the police. We've called 911. No one is telling us what they're here for and what the reason of this is. We're very scared. We just want to be, have everything documented. Ce qui est certain, c'est que la plupart du temps, ces situations ne dégénèrent pas. Il s'agit juste d'une horrible frayeur. Mais ça, c'est pour les citoyens qui en souffrent, car pour les policiers qui font l'erreur, ils subissent une honte digne de l'enfer. You guys just came. Listen, oh you guys my God. Hey. Yeah. My oh, attorney yeah. is going to okay. eat yeah, this. Yeah, we're, we're gonna we're gonna get in a lot of trouble. Cool. My lawyer Listen, is going to I'm eat sure. this. Where is he at? I have no fucking idea. You see them cameras right there? That's good. You guys are fucked.